This video is brought to you by VolunteerAudio.com, your number one source for all things Harley-Davidson audio, from individual radios, speakers, and amps, to complete plug-and-play amp and speaker systems, we've got you covered. And once you've ordered your package from Volunteer Audio, it includes lifetime tech support, and we have the very best step-by-step -step installation video, so you can install it yourself and save money. Hello, I'm Jay, owner of Volunteer Audio in Oliver Springs, Tennessee, and I've got this beautiful 2013 Road Glide. So Dennis brought this to me for a, a large audio upgrade, and we're gonna go over each step of this. It's gonna get the new Soundstream Reserve HDHU 9813RG, that new Road Glide radio that looks more factory than the stock radio, but gives you those modern features like Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. But we're not gonna stop there. Uh, we're gonna upgrade the front speakers to precision power six and a halfs. We're gonna show you every step of this. We're gonna add an 800 watt precision power amplifier in the fairing, meant just for this road glide. It mounts in it perfectly. We're gonna show you how to cut the six by nine lids in. So we're gonna add our cutting kits with new grills, add those six by nines and show you that process also. Very excited, this is, Dennis has the same issue that most people do with these bikes. It's a beautiful bike. He's took great care of it. But now he was at that point, do I buy a new bike to get modern features? And in this case, he said it saved him a ton of money because when we get done, it's gonna sound as good as any new bike. It's gonna have those modern features, yet he's not gonna pay the $30,000, $40,000 it takes to get a new bike. So hang out as we go over this step-by-step. -step. I'll show you how to do this yourself, how to bring your bike into the future and make it where you can save some money as well. So here's our new six and a half inch precision power. Uh, this is the MAS654, it's a four ohm six and a half. Here's our factory speaker. And I just want you to kind of look at the total build quality. Number one, how big the speaker is in comparison, how much more surface area we have to generate sound. We also have an integrated tweeter in the middle of the speaker to give us a good crisp high range. But look how much bigger that magnet is. So much more magnetic property. This is just like what comes in the newer Harley speakers. It's terrible, won't even pick up a screw. Uh, there's, I don't know where they hide the magnet at. But somehow or another it played for a long time. Uh, I don't think it played when it got here. Uh, but this is a much, much better improvement. Much lower mid bass. So we're going to get a more full sound and more overall volume. All right, we've got our radio in, our front speakers are in. Our next step is to prepare to do our amplifier and to run our wire into the back. We're gonna remove the seat and the gas tank. All right, so now we've got our gas tank off. We're gonna remove the cover going up the backbone of the bike. We're gonna expose the factory harness. This is where we're gonna run our rear speaker wires as well as the power and ground from the battery up to our new amplifier. All right, so when you buy your amplifier from Volunteer Audio, we do things way different than most other places. We try to take as much of the work and the guessing on your end out and do it on our end. So your harness is completely plugged in where it needs to go on the amplifier. The amplifier is mounted to a plate, and that plate's already mounted to the brackets we need for your road glide. As well as that, you'll see on the end, all gains and filters have been preset, so we don't have it where you adjust anything on the amplifier. It's already done. We know you're using this radio. We've set the gains here with an oscilloscope before it ever leaves out and all the high pass filters correctly for your size speakers. So let's get this thing mounted on the bike. All right, so before we move forward, uh, all I did was I took all that radio wiring and amp wiring and we just tucked it up to this side. We zip tied it around factory harnessing to hold it there. There's a huge void there that won't get in the way as we put our fairing on. But the key is keep all of this clean. I'm going to preach this over and over and over to you because the number one tech call I get on one of these year range bikes is oh, I think my radio is keeping my fairing from going on. I think something about it's not right. Maybe it's the plug. The key is it will go on. I'm going to show you it go on and we do this over and over as long as we don't have wiring where these hooks go. So we've got to make sure it either runs below it or in behind it. This plug does stick out close to this hook. 
and it will trick you into thinking it's the problem, but it is not. It will go right in. The factory plug stuck out just as far as well. So now we're going to get our backbone fished up through here and plug it in for our rear speakers, along with our power and ground, so we can plug it into our amp. All right, I'm excited. I got Dennis here and I've got his 2013 Road Glide. It's a beautiful bike. And the only thing that makes people want to trade in a beautiful bike like this a lot of times is features, things they don't have that the new bike has. That's it. Uh, and this is what Harley had given him. He had this CD player and two of these. And I'm gonna tell you right now, you cannot hear this music clearly going down the highway with these factory systems. It hurts. So we've, uh, We've got this Game Changer radio from Soundstream Reserve. We've got this 98 to 13 RG, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, beautiful touchscreen, optically bonded glass. So it looks really good. It's very bright, whether we're at night, we can dim it down, but during the day, we're gonna be able to see it with the sun on it and it's waterproof. So we don't have to worry about washing it, getting caught in the rain. But we also added an amp, we added better speakers. And it's time to get to hear it, see how good it sounds, see if it's loud enough to hear it going down the road and Hopefully a whole lot better than what we started with. No doubt. So let's let's play something real quick here. Tell you what, it's very oh. dynamic now. We've got some good oh. clean highs. It's clear and it's very, very loud. But it's got some good fullness to it. And I wanted to play something a little bit more of a, maybe a country feel. We do a lot of rock sound, sounding songs, but I think it sounds pretty good. What do you think? I love it, I love it. I think you, this is- <laughs> You saved me at least $30,000 trading <laughs> well, on a new bike. Well, good deal. That's, that is the plan. Make people happy with what they have. Uh, we also hope that you watched our video and it encouraged you I hope you can make the trip here to Tennessee. Come visit us, see the Smoky Mountains, ride the Dragon, the Devil's Triangle. We've got a lot of great places to ride around here, but you can come see us at Volunteer Audio and we'd love to do this install. But if you can't do that, or maybe you're trying to save some money, I hope these step-by-step -step videos, I hope they encouraged you to take on something like this on your own. And uh, hopefully each one of them will help you see that this huge project we started with, with this large amount of product over here on the table, and it looks just like so much to take on, when we break it down into these little videos, it, it makes it where it's a very manageable task to do this yourself. So, um, so grateful and thankful for people like you, Dennis, that, that come out here and visit us. 
I hope we made you feel welcome while you were here. Well, I would like to say one thing to you, Jay. You impressed me when I talked to you about six months ago. I told awesome. you what I wanted. You told me, hey, I see some things coming down the pike. You might want to wait just a little bit. Good advice. <laughs> I followed your advice and uh, set the appointment up because I, I come over and watch you in the shop yesterday. I was impressed with your attention to detail and uh, the quality work is, this is, uh, this is the example of what I got. And I'm so, so happy, man. Well, yeah. thank you for letting us do it. All of our kits are built for motorcycles. They're built for the weather. They're built for the abuse of what this is. This is a full precision power setup. We did the MAS 654s in the front fairing. We did the MAS 694, 6x9s in the lids. The amp is meant for motorcycles. It's all two year warranty. It's all, if it gets wet, it's okay. And so many places will sell you a car system for your motorcycle. We don't want to do that. We want happy people. We want you to refer people later on. And, and believe me, whether you buy it and you do it yourself and you have trouble, or we install it and you have trouble, we'll fix it. Oh, that, no that's, you know, things happen. If they do, we're going to take care of them. Uh, but I want you to know everything's been thought out, meticulously designed to go on your Harley. And I'm just grateful to be able to do all of them. Thank you so much, Dennis. And I hope this has... We're not going to do a walk away today. We just really don't have time to do all that. We've got to get this loaded up. We've got to let Dennis get back to the house. But it, I, I'm just so grateful to how it turned out. And I think it's turned out wonderful. It sounds good. Oh, and awesome. I hope you can hear it on YouTube. YouTube never sounds like it does in person. So even if you don't have us install it, drive down. Listen to the sound room. Listen to Project 5.0. Let me let you hear something we've done in person because it's going to blow your mind. It sounds good on, on YouTube. You can tell it's better in stock but it's nowhere near as good as hearing it here. And we'd love to meet you anyway. So thank you so much for watching. Please call us if you have any questions at one 30 audio Visit our website at volunteeraudio.com. You can also comment below. We're pretty quick to answer your questions on there as always. But thank you for watching. Please like this video if you, want, if you like it. YouTube's going to move us higher in search results. More people are going to get to see it. More people learn about volunteer audio, and we appreciate that. Also, subscribe to the channel if you like this video. If you like the content we do, you'll be able to see more of it. You'll see step-by-step -step videos, the latest in Harley Audio as it comes out, and some of the work we do like this that we'll get to show off and let you see how the end result was to maybe help you make that better decision. But thank you so much for watching, and as always, God bless.